Hey guys, and welcome back to Muramasa the Demon Blade. Last time we started off uh, Momohime's story, and uh, we learned of the existence of big breasted fox. Okay, I'm gonna stop about that now. Um, we learned that basically we are possessed by. Oh wow, it's a little bit loud, I think, but whatever, I'll deal. Uh, we are possessed by uh, Izuna Jinkuro, and. Um, after we fought some dudes, uh, somebody ran off with Momohime's soul, and if they hurt her soul, the body will die. And if the body dies, we die, so we gotta go find that soul. So, yeah, that's not good. We don't want that to happen, because we're the good guy! <laughs> Clearly! <laughs> God. Oh, well, whatever. I play, the I play good guys all the time. I'm so used to being the good guy, like an infamous. I'm the good guy. Okay. Whoa, that was crazy. I didn't even mean to... D that wasn't even my intention. Did you see that? Like, I ran past the guy and then immediately did a low slash back towards him in which I hit both of them. I didn't even try to do that and I did that on accident. God. See, now the problem is I can't just go back and say, Damn, did you see that? Man, I'm so fast at this game. <laughs> I can't even make it seem like that was on purpose because it wasn't. Like, I'm not that good, let me tell ya. Whoop! Misty Slash is really awesome, though. I love that ability. Alright. Here, I'll give you the, the a good angle on her putting the sword away. Because it happens very, very quick. She, like, spins it once and then, uh, just puts it right into the sheath. Which is pretty cool, I like that. It's very dexterous. I don't know, I find it a little bit more entertaining and pleasing to the eye than uh, Kisuke, like, throwing it up in the air and then catching it. I don't know, there's just something about that that doesn't seem as, uh, cool. I don't know, I mean, that seems completely stupid to say that, but there's just something about it, you know? Maybe because, you know, I've been a gamer for so long that I'm impressed by quick, small... Did that ninja just tripped without doing anything? But, um... I guess because I've been a gamer for so long that quick, very dexterous hand movements are uh, impressive to me. I don't know. So when you when you can do something without much effort going into the rest of your body, I guess it just impresses me because I'm used to doing that all the time. So it's like, wow, you can do something like that without even using most of your body's muscles. That's impressive. You know, because I'm used to doing that. Because my work is literally just pushing buttons. <laughs> All right, so that's them. God, she is so fast. Like, I love fighting as her. It's weird. It's one of the very few times where I'm like, damn, this female protagonist is completely awesome and, like, way better than the male protagonist. Not that I'm sexist. It's just that usually in games, the female protagonist, you know, for some reason or another, maybe it's the video game designers, but they don't seem quite as good, you know? And now we're here in Sagami. Where are we, anyway? Oh, we gotta go to Musashi. Okay. Yeah, you see what I mean? We're, we're already here in Musashi. So, you know, where this was the final area for Kisuke, it's like the first area for Momohime, which is cool. And I'm going to be calling her Momohime. I'm not going to be calling her Izuna Jinkuro, or just Jinkuro for short. I'm not going to be calling her that. I'm not going to be referring to her as a he. So, yeah. But when I'm talking about her... It's just gonna be her, you know? So if that's weird, sorry, but that's just what it's gonna be. Get out of here. <laughs> that was funny. He threw his little scythe up in the air and it got caught on the ceiling. That was funny. I like that. That's a nice little detail right there. Get out of here. Don't make me leave. There we go. Come on. There we go. Whoop. Yeah, still no store where I can buy food, though, which is very unfortunate. And there's a treasure here. I would love to get that. Wait, does she actually, like, gradually start... Hang on, I'm gonna have to check that out, because that was very cool. Ooh, I, kept, I caught you in midair. That was cool. Come on. 
Come on, Pierre Kirby, just die. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I like Pierre Kirby. All right. But there was something that happened with her... Yeah, sure enough. Oh my god, that's awesome. Uh, I don't know if you could tell, but just then, her running animation, it actually started out slow. Like, uh, she starts out slower and then gradually starts running faster. That's awesome. I actually never noticed that before. It'll be much easier to see in an area where there's not so much grass and foliage in front of me, but that's really cool. I never noticed that before. Whoop. Is there anything down here? No. Okay, now where's this treasure? Because I want it. <sighs> so, um, did I already say I got Banjo-Kazooie? I don't know if I did, but I finally got Banjo-Kazooie today, and it's so awesome. Like, oh my god. Oh wow, a purple barrier right here in like the first area? Yeesh. Okay, I can't open that. Wait a minute, isn't that the, that's the same one that I did with Kisuke? That's the, the ghostly hour, isn't it? I think so. All right, let's see. Oh no, not you. Oh. Now I'm gonna show off the monk one again at this level to see if I can actually do it. You know what I mean? Cause now I have all the skill I need to do it, but I wanna see if it's doable with the damage I can do. You know? I just wanna see if I can do it. Cause technically I have plenty of healing because I got the bamboo flasks, I got the healing pellets, the recovery pellets. I got a lot of decent stuff. It's just, I don't know if I can do it. So I'll do my best, but no promises. If I die, I probably won't be coming back to finish him off because I did it as Kisuke, so it doesn't really matter to me. Ninjas! I'd rather have a hundred of these bastards on me, you know? Whoop. I love that one. I love Ghost Wolf. <laughs> Even though for some reason, you know, maybe it's just me, but whenever I use Ghost Wolf, it's really hard to chain into other things. Like, you need immaculate timing to get that to chain to anything, you know? Like, even when I have, like, Ability Plus and Ability Plus 1, 2, 3, 4, whatever, I don't even remember which ones I actually use, but even when you have a whole bunch of Ability Plus skills, it's still really hard to, uh, boobs. But, yeah. Yeah, I don't want to save. Okay. It's really, really hard to, uh, to fun bags. So, yeah. God. If I'm ever talking and she's on screen, I'm gonna have to insert something like that. Yeah. Give me food. Because I need some souls, or some spirit. Oh, hey, it's the same thing. Herring soba? Ooh, that sounds good. See how much spirit it is. 1900, 1920, and 1440. 960. Yeah, that's half of it. Let's see. Uh, 480. No. <laughs> Kitsune Udon. That's pretty cool. Here, I'll have the herring soba because it sounds good. Ooh, that looks really good. Grr, I'm so jealous. I want some. Uh, and then, something that was really funny was that, uh, oh, I got a comment. I got a comment from somebody. I don't remember, I don't remember the whole thing. I don't remember the full comment. I'm sorry, because it was funny as hell. But the, the one room, the one line that I remember out of the comment was that they were talking about, like, torture or something. Oh, crap, I didn't mean to get that, but okay. Um... They were talking about how the game tortures you with something, but they said it's like, man, I wish the game didn't torture us with food porn. It's like, that's totally right. That that completely sums up exactly what this mini game is. It's food porn. It's like, ugh, do want, <laughs> but you can't have it because it's just food porn. No, I won't. I would if I remember to, and if I was a real person. No, I don't feel like talking to you. Um. <laughs> Like, nah. Because you guys always say the same thing. Uh, no. Yeah, now I'm able to use the map. Woo, I don't care. Forge. Let's see here. 
Ooh, a uh, swallow saw. That sounds cool. Flash. <laughs> Flash. Uh, I don't have enough strength vitality, but whatever. I don't care. Umitsubame Muramasa. And let's see. Fairy bolt. That's cool. Uh, let's go ahead and make this. Yes. Uh, Getsue Muramasa. Okay. Now I need more souls. Alright, that's fine. So one more level and I ought to be able to equip both of those. That's cool. Uh, let's see. But yeah, um, so far in Banjo-Kazooie, um, I've gotten pretty much 100% in all the worlds I've played so far on my own. Aside from one, uh, honeycomb piece. Which was, I don't know how the hell you're supposed to find it, but, uh, I could not find it on my own, sadly, so I had to use a, a, a video to do it. Rice balls, definitely want those, and cabbage hot pot, definitely want that. Ninja belt, I will take it. Uh, cabbage. And there. Okay, so I got one dollar. <laughs> now I'm able to cook. Thank you. And I'm gonna, oh, I don't need it right now, but, eh, I won't make the rice ball just yet. But hey, I can equip a new sword. Uh, 12, 13, this goes to 17. Windmill, nice. What do we got in here? Uh, okay, what do you gotta say? <laughs> okay, so you just made a haiku? Okay, whatever. <laughs> the ancient pond. Uh, wait, what was it again? I already forgot. It's like the an ancient pond, the frog jumps in then something else. I don't remember the third part. It isn't a bad haiku, to be perfectly honest, but I don't know anything about haikus, so, yeah. So, yeah, uh, when you have, when you're playing as Momohime, you actually have a different, uh, like, icon. Instead of the skulls, you have the flower. So, yeah. Alright, but yeah, oh, and now you can actually see it perfectly. Watch me run, and you can see that it's actually a, a slow animation. She builds up to her full speed. See? So yeah, like if you watch her feet, it's easiest to see with her feet because you can actually tell the speed because it starts to blur at max speed. So watch this. Just watch her feet. You see? I just think that's really awesome. It's just a very... That is a very, very good animation because all the times I've played this before, I never noticed it because it's so smooth. Windmill! <laughs> But yeah, that's, that is just an incredible animation. It's so smooth that I never noticed it until now. That's how you know you got good animation, when it's so subtle that you barely even notice it. But okay, um, let me see. Where are we going? Okay, we're going up. I thought we were going to a different dungeon here, but no. Oh, man, don't fall down there. That skill would actually be a lot more useful in just an area with solid ground, but this area, not so much. <laughs> Quick, hide! Aw. Oh, couldn't hide. Let's see. Can I hide at all? Uh, wait. Okay, wait. I will get this. Ah, oh, wait. I will. Hang on. There. How about now? Turn around. There we go. And... Yeah! Kinda. There! Perfect! I'm hiding! <laughs> okay, I took way too much time just trying to get the friggin' camera to line up with that thing. Uh, let's see, another peddler. What do you got? I don't have any money, but I may as well check. Radish. Oh, a map of Musashi! Grr! Radishes. I don't need no radishes. I don't like radishes. They're gross. Oh, hey, what's this? Bronze mirror. Too bad he can't sell things. That would be so nice if he could sell stuff. Oh, hi. 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 Ugh. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I can't help it. You shut your mouth. Oh, my God. Okay, nope. Oh, boom. <laughs> I can never... I can't help myself. I gotta do that every time. At least when it's a big... Like an important uh, quick draw when I'm about to kill somebody. Uh, wait, turn the map to the small one. 
Oh, that's gonna be a theme. That's gonna be a thing. The whole me ogling Kongiku. I, oh my god. I can't help it, man. You wouldn't be able to help yourself either. Man, even straight chicks with motorboat, those puppies. Like, oh my god. <sighs> okay, get down. Thank you. Because I knew there was a big soul there. Oh, again! Kaboom! Did I miss any? No, I did not. Good. The, the thing is, I'm always worried that I'm going to miss them when they're uh, down there, like off screen. That always kind of sucks. Okay. Oh, what do we got here? Souls! And an item. Goody. What do we got? Uh, Hinazumi dress. I'll go ahead and equip that because I don't have anything else. Or, wait, no, no, no. I do have the, I got the ninja thing, don't I? Yeah, I never put that on. My bad. Um, let me see. Equipment. Can't I make a new sword? Oh, wait, no. I can equip a new sword. There we go. And I can make this one. Or I can equip it. So, Sazanami. Now I need... Oh, damn. Oh, I gotcha. Because I lose my strength. Damn, that sucks. Okay, well, here. Let's just have three short blades, then. I don't mind that. Yeah. Blech. I'll do it. Wait a minute. This isn't the... Uh... Oh, this is like a, an enclosed area. I didn't... Huh. Oh, man, I gotta go down for the... Ah. Alright, fine. Look, nine or above. Let's try it. I'm, I'm gonna die. 100 armed monks. Alright, you bastards. Come at me. I'm gonna, do what I'm gonna do my best, but I highly doubt I'm gonna win. Now, the, it seems as though... You know, the enemies scale with their health, so, like, instead of hitting, needing to hit, like, 600 damage to kill them, I'm killing them with, like, 50 damage, because, you know, I'm only doing, like, 18 per hit. Ah! Jeez! You see? And that, that's half of my friggin' health bar, right there, from one little slip-up. There. Now most of it's back. Go away. Ah! Yeah! Stop it! Oh my god, you see? I'm doing the best I can to stay in the air, but they hit me before I can get up! Oh my god, I hate these guys! This is where healing pellets and other types of pellets really, really help. Ah! God, I hate you! Assholes! Suck it. I hate these guys. They suck. Yeah, scream, bitch. Whew. Damn it. I'm sorry. I, got, I really got to concentrate here. Otherwise, I'm going to die. Or I'm going to lose my sword at the very least, and that will lead to death. Damn it. I don't even know how many I've killed. I think this is like 30 or 40 now. No! Get out of here. Ugh. That's the other thing that's very frustrating about these guys. You can't... Like, if they're in the middle of an attack, it is almost impossible to stagger them. Ah! God, I hate you. Get, oh my god, get away from me. The only thing I like about you guys is your hats. That's it. God, I've already used like half of my freaking healing pellets or more. But then again, these these are weak-ass items I'm never going to use again. So I may as well use them now. Get some kind of use out of them, you know what I mean? Whew! Damn it! Oh, I hate you! God, I hate these enemies! Die already, you little bastards. How to heal again. Oh no, I'm not done. I know I'm not done. Oh my god. I wish I was, but I'm not. Uh, okay. Oh, 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 geez. 
Yeah, this is like a Daredevil run, and right after this, I'm going to play more Metroid, so it's like, oh my god. It's going to be two badass Daredevil runs tonight. Woo! Just die. Die, you pricks. Ugh. Oh, what the hell? I tried to do the big thing, and it didn't work. Hey, I got a good amount of them up here. Whoa, 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 whoa. No. No. Crap. Oh, what the hell? I didn't hit him? They must have been in the middle of an animation that made him invincible. Okay, there's a recovery pellet there. I swear to God, if I die, I'm going to be so pissed. Because I just wasted a whole ton of good items that could have been used elsewhere. You know what I mean? Okay. Not quite, but we're getting there. Damn it. Get out of here. Guys. Here we go. Ah, whoop. How did I not break a sword there? Oh my god! Ah, oh, I wanted to use windmill. No, 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 no. No, no. Okay, now I gotta have to start dealing with fullness. Oh, it's broken. My bad. <laughs> that might account for some issues. Get out of here. God, I hate you. Okay. I will win. At this point, I am committed. I gotta win. Okay. But yeah, you see what I mean? Like, I just came out of the freaking out. Like, the final boss with Kisuke, I just beat him, like, 20 minutes ago. So, or not 20 minutes ago, obviously, but you know what I mean. I just beat him not very long ago. So I'm riding off of that high, you know? I am using that amount of skill right now. So you gotta be really, really good to beat this. And the thing is, the enemies scale with you. So it's like, oh my god, you're going to throw this at a player who's just starting, presumably? You know, because it depends on whether or not you're playing Momohime first. So obviously, it depends on the type of player. Die. Yeah, and use your quick draw whenever it's available, unless you need to swap swords. In which case, you're just going to need to swap swords, regardless of the situation, with your quick draw. Oh. Okay. Oh my god, I think this might be the, either the last one or the second to last one. Ouch. God damn. Okay, that's a whole bunch of... Ouch. Jesus, man. Thank you. Okay, I'm guessing it's the second to last. No, oh, thank God. Oh. Kusari Katabira. Whew. That is not easy. And that took a very long time. I'm done. After I equip this. What does it do? Ah, defense. Okay, I like that. Oh my God. So, I am going to go back to the, uh, the immaculate pair of tits to go and save. You shut the hell up. Oh, no, 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 my sword's broken. No, oh, my sword's broken. <laughs> I don't care. There's going to be a lot of that, just so you know, if you're sexist, or I mean, like, if you're if you're feminist, then I'm sorry. I'm just doing it to be funny. That, and I really honestly don't care. So, please don't be offended. I'm not trying to offend anybody. It's just, oh, my God. I can't help it, okay? I really can't. So yeah, I'm gonna go back to the boobs to save. It's no longer a save point. It's just a, it's just the place with the boobs. And actually, uh, it's really funny because uh, if you look at the artwork for this game, um, like if you don't, here's the thing. You might be thinking to yourself, oh well, they couldn't have made it. like. Surely the sprite, it doesn't really look like that. And, and like my eyes are just playing tricks on me because I'm a perv. No, 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 no. Those characters are 
fully intended to be like complete sex objects. Like really. Like look up um uh I I might actually put in the name of a link that you, or like a Google search that you could put in to see the pictures, but like seriously, it is completely blatant. It's not like porn or anything, but oh my god, it is completely obvious. So yeah. Anyway, next time on Muramasa the Demon Blade, we're going to actually go to the dungeon that we are supposed to go to. And wow, she just turned toward the camera. Oh my god. Anyway, uh, see you next time. I'm going to go uh, be alone with myself for a little bit.